Hey guys, D Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays with some Mega Man X2. Two bosses remain. Very close to the end of this game. I know that might sound lame. But we gotta stay on frame. Okay, that was not the best. If you like horrible rhymes and almost being done with this game, if you could like this video, comment, and subscribe. We are headed to the desert base to hang out with the Overdrive Ostretch. Let's do it. This is actually a boss that if you start with it, you might be better off because similar to Chill Penguin and Mega Man X1, I almost said two, Mega Man X1, Chill Penguin gives you the feet upgrade. If you're into that kind of stuff, if you're into the feet. Not me, but anyway, um, whoops. So, just something to consider. Fun fact as well, if you come here and use your spin wheel from Wheel Gator and you want to take on one of the bonus bosses, this is where you do it. That's literally it. I also really noticed that in this game, whoever did the Music programming must have been like a bass guitar player because there's just so many moments where it's just like boom, 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 boom. I'm not complaining. Love a good bass guitar. Just a lot of it. Doom, ba, doom, ba, doom, boom, boom. And as you can see, here's the gimmick to this level. You can see it in the background. That's the speeder bike, which we will be uh, dealing with here shortly. I'm sure it'll go perfectly fine. How many lives do I have? Two. Okay, so we have the normal amount. I would really love to accumulate more health ups, but I feel like that's not going to happen. Oh boy, here we go. All right, so there is something that I need to be mindful of when you do use the speeder bike is this is going to be, there's two things we can collect in this stage that are important for progress. And in order to do that, you have to be a little precise with the speeder bike and I'm probably gonna screw this up. So we may be doing the, the old continue. But first things first, if you hit the Y button, you can go pew 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 and kill your enemies so you definitely want to do that and we want to go and crush this weird sand generator i got two healies out of that big fan of that and then of course we gotta go back oops didn't mean to do that we gotta hop on the bike Whee! you won't take damage on the bike which is nice but we're looking for a specific... Okay, that was it. A specific, a specific barrier. I was like, oh, I know where it is. And then I didn't. So, oops. Yeah, we might be continuing on this one. I, I have a feeling because... My reaction time there was clearly not it. That was not adequate enough for Mega Man X2. Not in this universe. And we have to destroy the sand generator thing again. I don't know if you need to do that or if it like prevents you from being able to make the jump that we need to do. But it does give you the... Yeah, they got a full sub tank to fight Mr. Ostretch, which is nice. I've actually been to an ostrich farm. It's an odd family vacation for people in the Midwest to be taking, but oops, I missed it again. Wow. Okay, so there's a long stretch and then death. We'll try to remember that. I'm gonna have to beat the boss in one turn then, which I feel pretty comfortable with. But anyway, if you hit A, you can do a little dash and then wee. Okay, didn't mean to do, oh. <laughs> it's like when you're trying to pee and you're a gentleman and okay. So, I don't know if there's anything up here. Ooh, maybe there is. I actually have never been up here. And I went right past the thing. Yeah, I have no idea what this is. This is probably just a life. Maybe the other side to the... What? What is the point of... The... What? Alright, let's get the little doodly-doo out here then. What do you got for us, boy? Am I supposed to be... Okay, the crystal snail's item is probably nothing. I think that's the boss's weakness. 
Silk Shot. <laughs> Does this not do anything? <laughs> Come on, work! All right. Magnet Mine. Okay. Speed Burner. No? Okay. If there is something there, I don't know what it is. I explored for you viewers. You can't say that I didn't do it. I need to get another bike for that impotent wall. It needs help. It's a pretty stiff situation. All right. Okay, that's a continue. Not like you really missed much. There's my numbers. Not that it matters. Call my number. All right, let's go back. That was a little bit of an exploration. We're learning about ourselves, about our body. It's okay. But anyway, yeah, I went to an ostrich farm in Aruba. Strange place, little Caribbean island. Pretty fun trip. Ostrich farm is a strange thing to do, but it was neat getting to see them in person. They are exactly as large as you would imagine. Very huge. And uh, also very aggressive eaters. One of the things you could do at the venue was you could pay to feed them. And we did, of course. Do I get my full... Oh, I got my sub tank still. You can pay to feed them, as you should, because it's fun and they're crazy. But, you know, they're very large birds. Apparently their eyeballs are bigger than their brains. I think that's something that I learned. It's been a long time. And, uh, yeah. Very aggressive eaters. They would give you basically what amounted to a large ceramic bowl that was like something you'd use for a dog. And then you... They'll have you face away from the fence, so you can't see them coming. And then they will run up to you. They're very fast. They will run up to you, and then they will aggressively peck. Let me take a, let me peek at this real quick, just so I can see what it looks like, so I don't forget. Oops. Excuse you. All right, so we have the little land bridge here. This, and then you jump. Okay. We do need this. Now, the worst part about the fact that I've messed this up so many times is that this isn't even the toughest part. Getting to this spot is not the tough part. But anyway, the ostriches will run up to the fence when they get told it's meal time, and then they will aggressively go after it. It's kind of wild. All right. Okay. Um, can I make it back? All right, cool. We'll try again. Do I need to... I think I have to hit the speed boost before I get to that point, obviously. I'm just taking so many damages. This episode is being artificially inflated by me being poor at this game. All right, there we go. We'll try it again. Oh, these bozos. Whee! Here we go. Oops. Okay. So apparently you got to knock that down in the process too. But yeah, they don't tell you when the ostriches are coming. And then they will just go pop, 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 pop. Really aggressively pecking the the bowl to get all the food out of there, these pellets of food. It's kind of wild. And I think there's a picture of me out there as a kid where I'm just like looking like completely shocked. Okay, this is really tough to... Oh, it's already knocked down. Okay. So what happens after I knock it down? Oh, I got to go up inside the building. Okay, and then... You got to... What? You probably have to do a, a speed boost here. Yeah, this is <laughs> this is definitely going to happen in one try. Oh no, did I lock myself out of it? No! <laughs> oh, that's okay. We'll come back for it another time. I don't want to waste any more precious moments of this wonderful series. Anyway, what I was, I'll show you what I was trying to do. There is a... Uh, there's, a, there's a, a heart right here, and you need the bike to do it. That's what I was trying to do, so... We'll be making a revisit to the Overdrive Osage stage at some point. Whoop. Now this is why I... This is probably one of the most important things in the game to get. You can only come here once you get the spin wheel, so... You have to take out Wheel Gator first, but then you can come here right away if you want to. This enhancement will modify your main drive. Ooh, I love it when you modify my main drive. Be able to dash in midair. Heck yeah, boy. 
Now, don't get too excited. This isn't like Mega Man X3 where you can dash in the air and like go up. That's it. So I mean, we have this and we have this. <laughs> so that's it. Uh, like I said, we'll come back for the the heart container later. Not worried about that. We're actually gonna make a... Oh, this is just the boss right here. I think the boss is weak to crystal meth or crystal snail's item. That's just it. You get the leg upgrade and then... Oh, no, we're not. Oh, there's a... There's a big old rocket. Okay. Is this a rocket ship? Are you happy to see me? Okay. A little cutscene for you. We do need this leg upgrade in order to get the the eventual things that I'm gonna do after this, after this fight, which I've never done. This is a pretty cool fight though, from what I've seen. Oops. Probably would help if I put the Oh, he's shooting little moon rings at me. Quit. That should have hit me. Alright. Crystal, whatever. Yeah. Oh, that's it? Oh, that really stuns him. Okay. He doesn't do a ton of damage, though. Okay, that time it hit me. I was going to say, probably going to hit me at least once. Not super easy to dodge. Is this all that this is going to be? You just got to kind of go even odds on it, I think. I'm not doing a great job at that. Yeah. <laughs> I dodged it successfully the first few times on accident, and then I haven't... Well, okay, there we go. Yeah, this... Okay. I want to show a little bit what he does, though. So I'm, I'm going to lay off that for a second. See if he'll do it. There he goes. He runs around a lot, like an ostrich would. Oh, there you go. That's a fun little animation. Is he going to do it? Where'd he go? There he goes. Okay. So that, I'm glad I could show that at least before I cheese the thing entirely. That's kind of his little, little gimmick is he'll run around in the background. Oh, I try not to die here. He runs around the background. And he, they did a nice job kind of using the background as like, to give it depth, obviously, they're just shrinking and enlarging the sprite, but you know, you get the idea, it's pretty neat. But the real prize is not the item we get, or sorry, the weapon we get, it is the item we got. I said that completely backwards, wow. This item is a nothing burger. Woo! I mean, it looks cool. The Sonic Slicer. Give me a Limeade, please. Cherry Limeade. All right. There's my successful numbers, if you're interested in that. Wow. <laughs> um, but we are actually going back here to the Wheel Gator stage. I don't exactly remember where the thing that I'm trying to get is, but at the very least, you need to have the leg upgrade. Doing so will give you the... Can I go up there? Stop it. Quit. Stop it. I don't think this is anything. I don't know. I'm trying to get up here. But there actually is a, a spot in this stage that we can only really access, I believe, with the leg upgrade. I think you have to be able to do a mid-air dash. Which I don't think is, like, terribly challenging to do once you have... The leg upgrade, but I could be wrong. Let's see if I can figure this out. I actually don't know where it is, so... In my notes, it just says, Go to Wheel Gator stage, which is really cool. Thank you, past me, for being so considerate. Maybe that'll tell me where it is, actually. Oh, I didn't mean to use this. Oops, sorry. You just got, like, mega exploded. My bad. Boop. Can I see you on fire? Whoop, whoop. He's like, my shield! Stop it! Not a very strong weapon. Ooh, can I do this now? Ooh, okay. That's... Okay, that's kind of cheap that that gets him right back into this. Yeah, that's not... There's got to be some sort of like a... I think there's a an upgrade. The upgrade... In fact, it might be in, in, uh, in this stage. That we would need to get to that spot. And you can only do the you can only do the in the midair dash once, by the way. So you know you can't chain it or anything. Which is kind of annoying. Alright. 
I do want to have the... I think it's here that I need to do it. Maybe. Hold on. Let's hop out of this. Hop out. Hop out of this. Oop. I think we're onto something. Nope. <laughs> okay. That was kind of stupid, wasn't it, viewers? Oh, and it starts me all the way back here. All right. This is one of those things where um, this is this is one of the danger of going through a stage and not uh, not playing not playing attention, not paying attention to where stuff is. So, hit my mic stand there. Very nice. I'll try that again. I'm not going to actually be fighting anything, so that's not really a problem. But... Whoop. Just a second here, viewers. Let me check my notes. I'm not trying to... be too obnoxious. Okay. This is all for the greater good, viewers. Don't worry. I'm checking this for you. I don't hear anybody can complaining. I see, okay. So I think I went past it actually. Based on what my notes say. And those notes are called the internet. So here we go. <laughs> I will admit defeat on this one. I think I went too far. It said that there was an opening in the ceiling. Which I think we can only get from here. Yeah. Oops. There it is, viewers. We figured it out. You could probably do that with like the um with the next Mavericks item, I think. This is the final enhancement of the game. The X Buster enhancement. Charge energy in both arms. Shoot a double shot or to charge any weapon. Alright. So you do actually need this to get the heart tank, which I think I did try to get on my first attempt. And it's going to do a little demo. Thank you, game. Pow, pow. Great. So we do more damages now. And the thing that I was trying to get to... Wow, I, I completely whiffed on where that was. The other thing that we're trying to get to with that heart container is from... Um, it's past where the... Wow, it does, it does a lot more damage. It's past where the... Ride... I almost said ride sharing. It's past where the Uber is. Where this is, it's obviously further along than this. Get out of my house! Flap, flap. All right. Yeah, that's a that's a big uh, a big lie. Earlier, where I was trying to do the, I can't believe that I did that. All right, I, I've flown off to the left before. All right, so here's the here's the thing. So in the previous attempts, I had this dinosaur try to hit me. It'll like shoot little beams out after you, and then when you do that, you obviously can use the iframes, I think, but this is the intended way, I think. Hold on. Okay. So I think they just want you to do it this way. Okay. <laughs> Maybe not quite like that. I think you get the idea though, right? That's kind of what, that's kind of what they're going for. I think that that's enough height to get you. How many lives do I have? Oh, I have to do it on this try. Oh boy. I have to jump up and then release the speed burner. To give us enough height, hopefully. Ooh, there we go, viewers. I was really nervous for a second. I thought I did goof it. Okay. I'm gonna go back, hold on. Now that we've done this. That was pretty impressive though, right? Were you impressed? Now that we do have the charge up shot, we can... There might be a way that we can go back and get the heart here. So let's try to use the speed burner on this one and see if it works. I think that that should give us enough distance. It seems pretty 
potent horizontally. But that's two, two power-ups in one episode, viewers. I don't want to hear any complaints that D-Mike does not come through for you, because he does. Although I still want to know what was in that little carved out spin wheel area from before. That is really laggy when he does that. Like, not, not literally, but I imagine that people that play this game, once they get the arm upgrade, that it kind of messes with them a little bit because it definitely feels slow. All right, so I'm not gonna pay attention to pretty much anything I'm doing, which is a recipe for success. Blow that boy up. This is kind of crazy. I'm running into the final, you know, probably two or three episodes of this game. That's, that's so sad. All right, so we have to do this. Whoa! And I don't need that anymore. Should be able to just infiltrate. How do you get that? How do they... I have no idea. If anybody knows, feel free to chime in if you see this in the future, I guess. All right, so we don't want to we don't want to go past it obviously. I think we'll die in the process of doing this, but it should get us the heart. I don't know how close I can get to the edge. One step close to the edge, and I'm about to get a heart container. All right. So fully charged up speed burner. Do I have to like do the hold on. If I do the dash first. Yes. Okay. We'll sacrifice the life for it. Worth it. Sac sacrifice my life for your heart. All right. Did that count? I hope that counted. I think it counted. All right. Well, obviously, there's only one more Maverick, so we'll take on that in the next episode, and then we'll wrap up the rest of this game. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. If you enjoyed this episode, if you could like the video, comment, and subscribe, and check out the YouTube shorts, and I'll see you next time for more. Bye.